Hello, this is Ugly Prepper. Today, uh, I'm out in the shed. Uh, it's a rainy, dreary day where I live. Uh, so, a lot of rainy, dreary days get spent in the shed here. Uh, you know, I'm just trying to show you around kind of what all's in here. Gas jugs, a little bit of everything. Um... But today, uh, I thought we'd talk about something a little bit different. I thought we'd talk about something most prepper channels don't talk about. And that is tools. Tools can be a commodity too. Um, you know, I'm not one really to loan out my tools unless it's somebody I really know. I have three or four core people that I would trust. Really not much more than that. This is my loaner set. This is for the village idiots around here that never bring nothing back. You can see it's got pieces missing already. So this is my loaner set right here when they need to borrow something. Uh, I'll let them borrow this if they need a tool. Uh, the rest of this stuff kind of stays in the house here. Uh, tools. Uh, I just bought some tools yesterday. I went to Home Depot and spent, you know, well over $100. Bought me some new channel locks. Bought me some new uh, adjustable wrenches, uh, stuff like that I really need for, um, you know, I'm not much of a mechanic, uh, but uh, I'm a home homeowner and, uh, you know, you have lawnmowers and you have four-wheelers and things that need tools, you know, to adjust uh, the chain on my four-wheeler or whatever. So you need tools. Uh, I don't know. Air compressor there. Uh, our little portable air compressor under there. So we got some tools here. And uh, I just kind of had all this stuff laid out, taking inventory and uh, doing some marking with my Dremel tool hanging there. I, I'd use that to put my mark on all my tools. And I was marking all these new tools, and I thought I would set all these tools out. Kind of uh, take inventory of what I've got, take some pictures uh, in case something ever gets... In case my build never gets broke into or whatnot, it's always good to have uh, that type of stuff for insurance purposes or whatever. But I thought we'd talk about some tools today. It's always good to have tools. You know, uh, I can imagine in an emergency, people might need to use tools. Um, so, you know, I just thought it would be a good short video to talk about tools. I even got my little uh, multi-tool out there. <laughs> You know, we have our freedom tools, uh, and, you know, that we use for freedom, and so it's good to have tools. Uh, it's, uh, it's good to be able to fix your own things around the house and uh, fix your own cars. I don't, uh, I don't own a car anymore, uh, but uh, it's good to be able to fix your own ride, you know, if it's something small. Uh it's good to have a few power tools when you need them, air tools when you need them. So we've got uh, a chop saw over here that hasn't been used in a while, but I've got a, a scroll saw. I've got a few tools in here I use from time to time, um, and they're good to have. You know, just like weed eaters or anything else, you need tools. That's a spray bottle. <laughs> so anyway, I just thought I would uh, spend just a few minutes and. Uh, Make a small video about tools and how important they can be in prepping uh, and survival, really, and survival as well. Uh, all right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you would. Uh, I would be most appreciative. And this is this is the ugly prepper. Uh, y'all have a good day.